So we need to be true to who we are and remember what's really important to us. That's what's going to keep Apple Apple, is if we keep us us. Thank you. I love hearing his voice and his inspiring message. And it was only fitting that Steve should open his theater. Thank you. It is the honor of a lifetime to be the first to welcome you to the Steve Jobs Theater. Steve meant so much to me and so much to all of us. There's not a day that goes by that we don't think about him. Memories have especially come rushing back as we prepared for today and this event. It's taken some time, but we can now reflect on him with joy instead of sadness. Steve's spirit and timeless philosophy on life will always be the DNA of Apple. His greatest gift his greatest expression of his appreciation for humanity would not be a singular product, but rather it would be Apple itself. We dedicate this theater to Steve because we loved him and because he loved days like this, where he could share our latest new products and new ideas with the world. And we do so not only to pay tribute to Steve, but to inspire the next generation of creators and innovators. Steve was a genius. And one of the many ways that he showed that was in the, his uncanny ability to unlock the talent of everybody that he worked with. He thought deeply about our workplace and its surroundings. And he believed that they should inspire talented people to do their best work. So over a decade ago, he began to work on a new campus for Apple. His vision for Apple Park was to create an incredible workplace of the future where engineers and designers could all be together collaborating on the next generations of Apple product to change the world. Steve's vision and passion live on here at Apple Park and everywhere in Apple, today and always. We honor him. <laughs> 